Hello my fellow Latter-day Saints, Kenzie Retro here, back once again. I'm recording this on Monday because... Oh, goody goody gumdrops. Season premiere of The Walking Dead. Spoilers will be inbound from here on out. So if you haven't caught up yet, this is your spoiler warning. So... Here we go. Let me hear. Take that shit, Rick. Okay. I'll die here. This is getting interesting. Brother against brother. You know me! We're going to war. Maggie? Look at the flowers. Talk to me. This is actually interesting. Rick Grimes' final episode. The confrontations are in the past. Rebuilding civilization is the future. It's the start of a brand new season of The Walking Dead. And stay tuned during the break for exciting competition news. The following program contains scenes of strong violence and horror. We just had this. Anyway, here we go. Rebuilding Alexandria. After th after everything they went through in the last couple of seasons. <clears throat> I can't believe this is going to be Rick's final season. Oh, man. They've got a woman. They've got a painting with Carl. Oh, man. What's that grumpy thing? You guys don't be there all first. You have a happy face, too. It's so sweet.
Daryl and his motorbikes, why am I not surprised? That is not pleasant. Hi. Using a walker as a makeshift scarecrow, that is brilliant! That is brilliant! Loud and clear, ponytail, what's up? Jesus! One of my favorite characters right now. Can you teach me sometime? I got a kids class at the hilltop you could audit. Hmm. Maggie will be there. Carol sometimes shows up when she's in town. Oh, speaking of. Charlie King Relay? Isn't there a way of like quietening the motorbikes? to the theme song we know! Come on! Good grief, the stay of the White House though! Oh my word, that is not pleasant! Hey, Michonne with the katana! King Ezekiel! The whole crew is here. Oh my word, these titles are pretty cool. I love the new title sequence. I'm impressed. I like the new title sequence. 10 out of 10 from me. Whoa, boy. Thanks, Michonne. Are they in the White House? Are they actually in the White House? I'd be very impressed if they are. Yo, 
out your list. Circle back here when you're done. Be safe. Imagine if that glass broke. Crash. Game over. Oh! That's nasty. No, we're gonna lose somebody already. Oh my word! Oh my word! Oh no! That is not pleasant by any stretch of the imagination. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That is not pleasant at all whatsoever. I don't like spiders. Intelligent design. The de evolution of man. I like it. You love that? Uh, yeah. We were fighting during the canoe ride at the county fair. It's funny, you know, certain things just bring up random memories like that. Does that happen to you? Most of the memories I got of my brother were fighting. But I had friends that fought with me. They wanted to be here. They didn't make it. Yeah, it happens to me.
few little side seats here. Brought my class back when I was teaching. And uh, they cultivated animal lines for the gardens. I kept seeds on them. Mm -hmm. We made a two-mistake hold without formula. We're grateful. The sanctuary will be too. Let's take the lot, get back, see if the others need help. So he called for an election? The one great idea Gregory's had. Is he still sore about the results? I don't know. He's being friendly. It's weird, honestly. The rebirth of democracy by that guy. Hmm, who'd have thought? Meanwhile, I live with a king. <laughs> but it works, right? People seem to like it. There's something about a vote. Here we go. A blacksmith can use these as a model to make more. And we can send one to the sanctuary. Try to fix things there. I'm glad you won your election. I'm glad I grew up on a farm. Easy. Last step. <laughs> That's gonna alert everything. Expecting it to just go tick, 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 crack, and then smash right on top of the walkers, and they're gone. That wouldn't surprise me if it happened. Let's go. Uh oh. Well, Either that or someone. Someone's gonna lose their grip. One more. Oh, oh. oh. The glass is cracking. The glass is cracking. It's gonna fall through. It's gonna fall through. Someone's gonna fall through. King Ezekiel. I called it. I said something like that would happen. I called it. I called that. Oh no, no, they're not gonna have Ezekiel gone in the first episode. Surely, no, no, they're not gonna kill. They're not gonna kill him in the first episode. Surely, no, 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 no. This. Come on. Oh my word. Come on. Oh no. Guys, come on! Stop doing this to us! 
What? Wow. Um, okay. I was not expecting yeah. that. new season and to celebrate we want to see your original fan art choose one of your favorite characters places or events from the show and create some original artwork you can then enter for the chance to win a cash prize and the chance to have your artwork judged by the walking dead's very own greg nicotero the winning artwork will be featured on the cover of shortlist magazine and exhibited in london to find out more and submit your entry visit twdfanart.co.uk now Pretty cool. One says The Walking Dead on Fox. Bye. He wants to learn to trade. Think your dad will take on another apprentice? I don't see why not. I can't tell if he likes me. He's just quiet. I mean, comes across as grumpy. I don't think I've ever seen the guy smile. Alright, it's just... He needs to get to know you first. Look, I think he'd appreciate the extra help, because the kingdom just sent this large shipment of scrap metal to melt down. Hell, shooting these horses is a full-time job. Well, it makes you feel any better. I was pretty sure he hated me, too. I was scared back there. Was too. Glad you're okay. Made me remember something. Been taken for granted lately. You can't wait on life. No. So, will you marry me? What? Put that thing away. It'll snag on everything. And I told you not to ask me that. I know. Especially after something like this. And this is not happening in the horse. Oh! <laughs> not to be such a buzzkill, Carol. Come on! No, such a buzzkill. I'll keep this till you're ready. Weather hurts, Mercer and Sylvia, so now it's even bigger. One of them came through here at the back end, took down the bridge, took the walkie repeater with it. How about Route A? Is that clear yet? Still too close to the hurt. You can get to Alexandria from this side. Stay there till it passes. No. Route A's taken days to clear before. I need to get home to Herschel. We could take Route D. It's early enough in the day. Keep an eye on the trade road in case anyone else tries to move through. Gabriel. Y'all can head back to Alexandria from here. The rest of us will go to the sanctuary or hilltop, stay the night, and head on from there. Take care. Get home safe. Rick. I just can't pull the wagon through this mud. Maggie, I think they need a break. Maybe we should leave the supplies. Then we go back in a day or two. It's risky. We've seen herds run through and destroy bigger things than this. We can swap out the horses. Split up, take them out in the clear. 
Give him a rest while we see what we can do about the trailers. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> That's not good. Uh oh. We're almost there. One more time. One, two, three. Good, let's get out of here. Daryl, Sean. On it. He's out, he's been bitten, and unless they chop the limb off, he's going to turn into a walker. Oh, brutal. Oh, that's a nasty bruise. Gonna at least take a few days to get away. To go away. If that. Gonna need to put him out of his misery. Tell me again. Tammy. Tell me again. Tell me what happened. Tammy has already said everything there is to say. I don't accept that. She took our boy out there, and for what? My son is dead, Pearl. And what do we have to show for it? Nothing but a broke plow. Isn't that right? We found more than just a plow. That run was really important for the future. Don't you dare talk to me about no future right now. I know where all that shit went, Maggie. The Savior's got it, didn't they? He didn't even die helping Hilltop. Now, Tammy, just calm down. I think I'm going to hit that little girl. I hate that woman. Look, what kind of man are you just to let this go? Let me, I'd like to help arrange a funeral. Me and Earl will bury our boy. Thank you. And you're not welcome there. What? I voted for you, Maggie Reed, but we're not friends. 
I understand. I really do. You know, Gregory has been saying he's the one who's always put Hilltop first. The man's a damn scoundrel. But maybe he's no fool. My son is dead. Your boy has no father. And those damn saviors eat our food and take everything that Hilltop bled for. It ain't right. She's got herself worked up over this one thing. He's dead. The fond ones have flown. Oh, who would inhabit this bleak world alone? I want to miss you, Ken. Heaven's a better place for having Sure. Well, it's just brutal that she can't get to his. He can't go to the funeral. Rick Grimes is here! That's the man that ended the war. Is Negan suffering? I hope he damn well is. Hello. All was well in your absence, other than a certain cabal of saviors slinging me some serious stake out, but I've compiled a list of items that need your semi-immediate attention. I checked out the supplies. It's a pretty good haul. You should let everybody know. I ain't getting up on the stage. Give a damn speech like him. It's a bad time when we just lost one out there. Daryl. Gene, Jerry, you know who did that? I don't know, man. That would be a negative. Justin, clean that up. How? You mean how? Paint over it. We just used up all the paint. Figure it out. Good heart, young man. He wasn't a fighter. No, he, he tended to our animals. He, he shooed the horses. If regular guys like Ken to keep the place going. <laughs> he will be remembered as a son, a friend, a shining example of hilltop strength fundamental decency even in the face of this terrible tragedy cheers Ken rest in peace Gregory that was beautiful something about this one Makes you think, if I want to have what you lost, I would just be grateful for what I already have. Storms will be here in a few weeks. Help us out. We're going to need a boost in the meantime. And you'll have it. We came back with farming tools, heirloom seeds. We're looking to the past to help us with the present. We're all going to pitch in and make sure that Sanctuary has what it needs so you all can get back on your feet. Bless you, Rick Grimes. Thank you. I've been. 
kept this place together. We kept people in line here. We can't just let the sanctuary fail after everything that's happened. I mean, it's gonna fail anyway. Nothing grows here. It's a damn factory, man. Look, when Negan was around, he needed people to provide for him. It's still the same. Nothing's changed. Well, it's different now. We give what we give willingly. How long is that gonna last? Most of the bridges are out after the big storm. The highway's gone. We've scavenged every drop of gas for miles. We can't make enough corn fuel to run the cars or the trucks. Pretty soon it's gonna be more than a day's ride from one spot to another. It's on us to figure out how to make it work. And there ain't no us anymore. Something tells me we're Everyone's gonna have dissension. That small group we had back in the beginning. We could do anything. That was right. That's what I know. You want to come home to Alexander? Go. Someone's got to take your place. Rosita and Eugene are headed to Oceanside next. Maggie's sending food, but not people. And Caitlin's got his own problems rebuilding after losing its fighters. If Alexander sends another person out, I could use the help back home. We're not together because there's a change. Bless you, and I thank you. Oh, I'll talk to you soon. Go ahead, Tammy, I'm fine. I just want to sleep. Get up against me. No, no. I mean, she's taking that most hard. Interesting. Things will kill you.
Merci. I want to take over here for a while. For you. Interesting. You want to bring Henry in the game? I'm totally mm -hmm. out. He asked me to marry him. What? Yeah. What? Well, called Daryl off guard? And part of me wanted to just say yes right then. Why didn't you? Um. I don't know. I'm gonna help out. Come on, come time. on. Give them the details. They are important. Mr. I'll tell you something else, Gregory. He didn't need to be out there. My son. Which reminds me. Throughout this whole episode, where the fridge is Negan? Where the heck is he? Justice for my boy. Maggie thinks she is above the law. You know that election? It's a joke. Who do you think counted the ballots? The buddy Jesus, that's who. Oh boy, here comes the dissension. This is gonna end well. You're just afraid to speak up. Maybe you'll do whatever her pal Red says, even if it's not good for them. I don't see that we can do a hell of a lot about it, Barry. She's the one that decides. It is the decision she's made and the priority she set to put your boy into the ground. I'm speaking plainly because I'm angry. I'm angry to see the liars at the hilltop. Your son's life being treated like the price of doing someone else's business. She's the leader. She doesn't have to be. Uh, ah, the local uh, casino where well, you can. do the right thing. Sometimes I think maybe we just should have killed him. If it was up to me, I would have just left him for dead. Killing him wouldn't have changed anything we saw today. They don't want me and they want food. We don't know that, Rick. Not for sure. I'm thinking, maybe we need an agreement between all the communities. Like, this is what we believe. This is how we treat each other. And this is what happens when we don't. Hmm. It's good. Interesting. It feels like the right time. Because it couldn't before. We're always running, fighting. Oh, it's smart. Building up. 
about something like that and pull people closer together. You know, Daryl's not happy. Gee, think? He's got me worried about things breaking down. You can say something unless it was important. Who cares? Too much sometimes. If he's worried, there's a reason. So what do we do about it? Thing we need to fix that bridge. Okay. I'll get the people. And how does one check. go about fixing said bridge? Charter. Not constitution. Charter. Okay. Tomorrow. Okay. appreciate that. I know this hasn't been easy for you. You won the election fair and square, Maggie. You've been a worthy adversary. Uh, forced me to do some soul searching. It's hard not knowing what your place is. I'm sure you have one if you want it. Yeah. Uh, anyway, I should get my kid to sleep. Oh, Maggie, I, I meant to tell you. We were burying Ken before. I don't want to say anything. Not now. It looked like someone had defaced Glenn's grave. Maybe just some sort of accident. The kids didn't know any better. I hope it wasn't that someone was angry. Probably no big deal. Check it out tomorrow. Good night. Good night. What the? And that's just woken the baby up. Who the hell is that? Oh my god, Maggie! No! Nice job on waking up the baby, you jackass! Margaret, yes, look, come on, Maggie, what happened? What happened? You tried to have me killed because you're too chicken shit to do it yourself. Margaret, you need to sit down. You obviously have a head injury. You want to leave this place? You can't even murder someone, right? This place? I built this place. None of this would exist if it wasn't for me. Oh boy, uh, like, like I say, here comes the dissension so much for a new beginning, which is the title of the episode, by the way, roll credits. You know what's funny? Is you can't go back to Alexander because you know who is still there. Can you even give a crap about all of the stupid shit that you have done after all the chances that you've been given? No. Oh boy. I don't know that you did this. I'll attack you because you got a son killed. You go with me. You will attack me. And I defended myself. Whoa! You do not make things personal like that.
We'll see you soon. Never I'm make things him. personal under any circumstances like that. I'm not running away. It kind of feels like you are. If I push too hard, my friends need my help. I want to be there for them. But I have a home I want to get back to. And that's enough for me for now. Now it is rude to do. I'll be content to move at your speed. Lady Caroline, oh, someone's getting formal. Though the waiting is such a sorrow. Jerry! Steve! Jerry, take care of him for me. This is why I love King Ezekiel. He's just brilliant. Funny. He knows it. He's a little stinker. He's just perfect. He really is. Yeah. I think I'll keep him. Not as if they're going to do that. Now the bristles a little older, and you're going on runs again. I'd love for you to visit Alexandria sometime, if you're up for it. Judith talks about Aunt Maggie at Hilltop all the time. I'm surprised she still remembers you, but she does. Rick, I can't. You know I can't. You came about something else. Oh. Maggie, you can pick him away. I'm okay. Just talk, talk to, to me about anything else, place. place. All right. Well, I need your help fixing the bridge. How on earth are they going to go about doing that? Because of you. This place is doing better than anywhere else. And you've been generous. Hilltop's given me so much already, but I'm asking for more. What? She's saying she worries still short on food, and a project like this is gonna take a lot of people and supplies. I'm asking if you'll be generous again. If you'll stretch. My people want to work on the bridge, I won't stop them. No, no more food and supplies without getting something back for it. What do you want? If the sanctuary needs food, I'll give it to them. But they provide most of the labor on the bridge for us. And they send over all the fuel they can make it from their dead corn. The sanctuary's barely holding on right now. We're obliged to help. Why? They surrendered? We didn't kill him. That's it. I can't solve all their problems when I clearly have things to take care of here. Maybe I'm so sorry this happened to you and Enid. I've survived worse. Maggie has to stop. You saw Glenn be killed right in front of you. And we 
haven't found our saviors. You told me that soon you'd be the one following me. But you didn't. Because I wasn't someone to follow. That changes now. It'll be dark soon.